Good morning, Arizona. Gibby here along I-10 near the Gila River Bridge with some good news, especially for those who are going to travel to Tucson. They are going to get ready to open up one lane here. Eventually, both lanes will be open back up to let the queue or the backup traffic get through. And then they have plans on how to get this fixed. I want to bring in Greg Byers, who is the Arizona Department of Transportation engineer out here. The first thing on this is good news is you deem it safe and you guys already have a plan on how to get everything going. That's correct. So the situation is right now the we, we had a hole develop in the aged uh, surface and uh, so right now we have a plan to patch it back up we're going to do that tonight starting at 10 o'clock uh, get it all done it'll take about 24 hours for the concrete to cure so we'll be limited to a single lane uh, for that 24 hour period and then we'll open it back up to traffic and as I mentioned, the good news here is you'll have one lane open uh, uh, right away, and then you're going to eventually open up that lane because you do have that steel plate over it that we saw from our Arizona news chopper. Uh, once that traffic clears up, you'll be able to go back to one lane to allow you guys to work. That's correct. So there's there's been a queue building all morning long, so we need to be able to flush that traffic through. Uh, once it normalizes, then we'll go back to a single lane closure and keep everybody off that plate just for safety purposes. All right. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. And Gina, you know, one other thing to note, especially if you're going to head to Tucson tonight, there will be a hard closure tonight so that Greg and his boys can get all that work done. And once they have it said, as he mentioned, that one lane will need a cure for at least 24 hours. So it'll be down to one lane before they're allowed to let everyone back on the bridge as well. So uh, some quick work here from Maydot, and they just wanted to keep everybody safe. That's why they had to make that closure over at Riggs Road. But now that uh, they deemed it safe, they're going to allow traffic to start rolling here pretty soon. That is that is really great news, Gibby. But in the meantime, let's uh, talk about the situation because uh, for right now, you're going to need an alternate, and it's just brutal traveling through this area. So a little different view. Here's a live look at the I-10. Uh, the camera's at Queen Creek. It's the one camera we have for this uh, current one camera we have furthest to the south here, south of Awatuki. The closure is down at Riggs Road, and you can see the backup leading up to this point. Uh, let's go ahead and go to the maps. And you know what? The computer doesn't want to work. It's been that kind of day. And you know what? Let me just space bar through this um, and just uh, leave the maps full here. So as we take you down uh, to where Gibby is, uh, this is another picture from our news chopper. And you can see that hole right there in the middle of the bridge that they're going to have to repair. So the closure is there at Riggs Road. It is the I-10 eastbound that's heading down to Tucson and Casa Grande. A couple of different thoughts here. If you need to get to Maricopa, exit the freeway early at Queen Creek Road. Uh, and then you can take the 347 down. If you're thinking, I'll go through Maricopa as uh, my alternate to get back to the I-10, look at all the slowing through town. So the other thing you can do is you can cut across the 202 Santan to the 101. So as you drop down the 101, it turns into Price Road, as you know, the 87 and the 587. But look at the tremendous backup here. The bottom line is if you need to get uh, to uh, Casa Grande, to Tucson, or some uh, point further than that, you're going to have to give yourself a lot of extra time even when they reopen the freeway, all the I-10 traffic will be pared down to one lane. So definitely going to add uh, time to your travels as you head south on the I-10.